the biggest thing I want to get across is there is a progression here. And I might have a, you're going to notice a template that I kind of follow. And I'm not saying it's perfect, okay? Uh, but the practices are going to change within that template because this is a progression, okay? And uh, the next practice that I'm going to go to is going to take care of layers four, five, and six, actually our dribble penetration stuff. Um, I'm not, if it was a youth team, I'm not going there. There's, no, there's just no need. It's not going to stick, you know? Um, uh, but if it's a team like this one, then I can't say, I would love to tell you that you can start putting in layers four, five, and six at this point in time. I'd love to say that. But there's so many variables that I can't because uh, every team's learning curve is just a little different. And you've got to kind of, you've got to continue to make judgment calls with these diagnostic tests. Is it sticking or is it not? And I think the best practice would be one where I've taken my practice plan and I've, I see notes everywhere that says, okay, they, they got that, but I got to spend more time. I got to double my time on Laker cuts. They ain't got that yet, you know? Or I can move on from this layer. They might be ready for this one. Or um, there's some fundamental that they're missing. I could see it in this. And I've got to go back and stick that in my uh, reaction drills. Um, uh, by the time we get to the very end, it's going to be more of big stuff rather than, uh, than so much uh, detail that you see right now.